excited to be here today in Goulburn for the annual forum Regenerating Country, Culture and Communities in the Great Eastern Ranges, KCW Link. We've got a great lineup of speakers and can't wait to get started. How nicely that was the to tie us into the themes of today, of connecting country, culture and communities. Basically this is a bit of a map of how the KGW partnership works. We, we are strongly project and outcome oriented. Some of the key challenges that we're facing today um, is our human health and planetary health. And I think it's a good way to introduce the concept of regeneration because in its simplest form, regeneration puts life back at the centre of our decision making. I'm so grateful to have respected elders like Aunty Alice to learn from. Aunty Alice has really taught me how important it is to respect and follow cultural protocols. Um, but unfortunately tree hollows are becoming more and more scarce as old trees are removed from the landscape, either by people or by fire. It's not only the fires that have been impacting them, the drought and the heat waves in the 2019 also were impacted greater global population. All this is made possible around the globe through the collaboration we have with local communities, indigenous and conservation groups, leaders, larger organisations, universities, all levels of government. And so if we don't help these animals by giving them a place to have their babies, then there's not going to be a healthy population before the next fire. This is a painting that one of our partners, Richie Allen, painted for us called River Dreaming. We think we own the land, as in, yeah, we bought it, we paid for it, it's ours. But stewardship is a totally different concept. We are, and I love the word of the First Nation people, we're custodians of the land. It, it means that there's a lot more people out there now that um, see land and landscapes in a, in a very different way, not just as, uh, as, a, as a place to, to grow resources. And it's absolutely pivotal that we give young people a voice, that young people are heard, that young people get the opportunity to take action on issues that are important to them and their community. Inspired by the speakers and reassured that there are solutions. I'm just loving the, the wide range of speakers um, in this whole um, global um, that we're you suddenly realise there's a lot of young people, a lot, lot, of, lot of ideas out there, you know? And you just suddenly realise that if we could just get a little bit more momentum going, you know, more young people involved, I was disappointed that there's no more younger farmers here today, you know? The power of collaboration, it's, and everyone talked to it, but to see it in action here today and have everyone talk and connect the dots of all the connections we already have in the room, but connections we could also make. It's, yeah, it's a really powerful thing and it's, it's how we're going to solve the problems going forward. Think about how many people that care about the planet and want to make change can't even name the birds that wake them up in the morning or the trees that are in their front yard. So I think the first thing to do is reconnect to your place. So, so learn about that, teach your kids, um, because then that creates that connection and then you can build out from there.